The first input is for a natural mineral water. It's so easy to make. You basically just collect rocks from your area, put them in a container and fill it up with water. Hang a fine mesh bag with leaf mold soil in it and let the microbes break down contaminants in the water. Cho says that this is a way to purify water using leaf mold soil. He says it takes only about two to three days and then the water will be excellent quality and you can use it to irrigate, make JMS, make JLF. The second recipe of the Jadam framework is Jadam microorganism solution, the microbial solution or simply JMS. And this is the backbone of the whole thing, honestly. If you choose to do one thing, I'd recommend learning how to make JMS. Fill a container with dechlorine water and then using a fine mesh bag of some kind filter through some leaf mold soil unrefined sea salt and a food source the most common ingredient is going to be cooked potato basically you're going to strain these ingredients through the fine mesh bag into the water and let the microbes feed on the carbohydrates in the water after a few days you'll see bubbles form on the surface of the water and this indicates microbial activity once the foam has reached its peak it's ready to be applied to your soil or whatever you would like to use it for i use jms to water my chicken coop bedding to wash my imo boxes as a microbial boost for finished compost and of course as a soil drench and plant foliar spray. Just make sure that when you use it on your plants, you follow the recommended dilution rates, which are typically one parts JMS, 10 parts water. P number three, Jadam liquid fertilizer. Now, once again, check out our full mini course if you want to get the big picture and the nitty gritty of JLF. I think the word fertilizer is actually a bit misleading because in all honesty, the amount of nutrients these liquid inputs are supplying to plants are very minimal and should not be considered a replacement for store-bought synthetic or organic fertilizer with the expectation that they will get you the exact same result in the first season. Instead, what I would suggest is that these are more accurately biomimickers. Primary function of the fertilizers is inherent in the way they're made. To make a JLF, you take plant debris, put it in a container, add some leaf mold soil, and cover it with water so that it is just barely covering the plant debris. Then let it ferment for a few weeks or even a few years, and you've got some seriously stanky sludge. As the microbes from the leaf mold soil are eating up their food source, the plant material that you added to the container, something is happening. The microbes are consuming a food source and then adapting and multiplying accordingly. So when you feed microbes from leaf mold soil tomato crop residue, say, you're giving them the opportunity to evolve and adapt to that food source so that they can better digest and process those nutrients breaking the tomatoes down into their base nutrient form. With the Jadam wetting agent, or JWA, we're basically making a Castile soap here. It's got three ingredients, super simple, but it does require a bit of care and attention to detail, unlike JMS and JLF that are more loosey-goosey. For the overview, you're basically mixing oil, lye, and water together to create a chemical reaction that heats up and emulsifies once blended into a surfactant. And this takes a few days to make. You want to protect your skin against splashing when the liquid is crazy hot. And otherwise, the Jadam wetting agent is fairly simple to make. You got to use soft water. Soft water is the key to the wetting agent spreading out and sticking to the plant leaves and the fruits effect. The next piece of the JNP puzzle is Jadam Sulfur. The method that he demonstrates for making it is one that requires no heating equipment, only the ingredients and a bucket with a, with a stirring stick. The last new thing Cho has as part of the JNP suite is the Jadam Herbal Solution. We're basically just boiling herbs in water to extract compounds and scents that are off-putting to pests. What is novel is the work that Cho did to find hundreds of different herbs that you can use to make the Jadam Herbal Solution. And the main three that he recommends in his book are Jerusalem Artichoke, Ginkgo, Berries, and Bracken. For our herbal solutions, we've just used Jerusalem Artichoke so far. 